sort of like um, home video. You know, like yeah. it seems like something real has happened. Yeah, that you, kind of thing. You found something really freaky. Yeah, thinking. yeah. Like I was thinking, like just something. Cause I was thinking, like what kind of horror movies, like what what is re- um, a shortcoming of like what a lot of scary things try to do, which is to, like kind of. I don't know, it's like almost trying too hard, or it's like making it, trying to be, it's like they try to make it really scary, like I think like if it's really scary when it's not even, when you don't even feel, like you know, you do scary makeup, it's like whoa, 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 like, where, and then they kind of rely on that as the scary content, rather than maybe like the placement of it, create like creatively, I was thinking like, just like, not even a I mean, like, yeah, not even, like, a very scary visual thing kind of placed in, in, a, just in a certain way can be really scary. Like, I was just yeah, thinking, yeah. like, a kind of, like, a thing would just be, like, someone sort of watching you from a distance and, like, kind of, but, like, kind of just, I mean, maybe, like, some kind of, I don't know, not makeup, but maybe, like, makeup. <laughs> like to make them look unusual so yeah. yeah just like slightly unusual but like not not like spooky necessarily just kind of like a kind of maybe just like a weird looking person that's kind of just like looking at you like in, so like, in, saying, in, in, in like maybe like in a kind of bushy area are you saying the shot is that <laughs> it's like, like it's, it's kind of like um, maybe it's like someone just kind of it's just kind of like walking I was even thinking like a vlog maybe yeah and it's just like Like you, you just kind of like stop suddenly, yeah. and then you kind of like start just like filming, and you like it's like a zoom kind of thing, and, you're like, Jesus and then like, oh, you just like not saying anything, yeah, because yeah. like, like kind of like what you really would do, you just be, because in that moment you actually you would be ignoring your vlog at that point in real life, you'd just be like, and then you'd in your own head about it, but, but maybe yes, like but filming video. and still filming because that's I don't know. like front like that that way. Um, or like or on your face. No, no, no like filming. Like, <coughs> yeah. I don't know. Maybe you just have you're vlogging like that, and you just turn around, and then it's like a zoom on like someone just like that. Uh, because I saw it. I, I don't know. I, I saw. I think it's done sometimes on like really old horror movies. Kind of quite successful. Yeah. We should um, look up like on YouTube like videos that. Are trying to do that, like trying to make more like um, home video aesthetic, like scary, scary like there would yeah. totally be people doing that. Yeah, like, yeah. What would you even look up? Like creepy, something creepy happened or something like that. Yeah. Well, I mean, like every ghost video on YouTube is like Other fat. ghost videos. That's good. We should look up some of the ghost content. Yeah, yeah. Right but I feel like even though it's like the ghost, I mean, like I reckon like, I reckon it should, there should be like mystery. I feel like it, like kind of. Just like not like even more supernatural ambiguity. stuff, just like, or like kind of like almost creepy in a supernatural way, but it doesn't, it wouldn't even need to be, I feel like, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> David Lynch kind of does it a lot, I was going to think about that. What would you search? Um, scary. Oh, I don't know. I mean, you could tell like ghost sighting or ghost, if you want to see that stuff. Live on TV. So, like, so that guy should just like. Oh, ghost over. It's well tailored to me. So. Top 5 Central. Today we're looking at the top 5 ghosts caught on live TV. God. Now, before we even begin, I want you to comment right now if you think ghosts are real or not. <laughs> it's a really debated issue, so I thought bringing you guys some videos about potential Love ghosts that. might spark up a huge conversation. Anyways, if you do go on to enjoy this video, make sure to drop a like down below. Also, if you want to enter our free Amazon giveaway, click the link at the top of the screen. It's not even like in the... Like, that's actually in the video. It's not real. Number five. Okay, so a day before Halloween back in 2014, a group of journalists from KTV and Channel 2 went out to the ruins of a house that was once owned by a man named William Goodburn, which is a man named alcohol that earned him the name Whiskey Bill. <laughs> Basically, KTV and met up with a paranormal group who went by the name Boogeyman NV, who had some pretty crazy experiences at the house. To kind of sum it up, they'd taken pictures of shadow people and crosses that didn't actually exist in the area. Not only that, but one of the men who were in the boogeyman group had actually been threatened by the ghost of Whiskey Bill. Apparently, after leaving a voice over on the house, the ghost died like... three different times, which is a pretty scary encounter. 
gets worse though because the quote unquote ghost had also written the words die pee and pebbles right next to the house. <laughs> now that's kind of odd because usually all this happened at night, so the camera crew weren't actually expecting to experience anything during their visit, but they were wrong. I'm not even joking, while giving an interview with one of the boogeymen, you can suddenly hear metal hitting metal from the house and the sounds of a man grumbling something under his breath. It's all pretty scary, right? Like honestly, I don't have a good explanation for what the news team experienced when they visited the area, but do you guys think it was an actual ghost or was it all set up for publicity? Let me know by leaving a comment down below. That's another thing. Yeah, it's daytime. Daytime stuff. The walls no longer yeah, exist here. Something else does. How haunted is this spot? Oh, on one to ten, about eleven. <laughs> Bill's body rests at this gravesite, about a hundred yards away from us. There was a black shadow figure. Like part of his lower legs were appeared to be actually underground. Got a cowboy hat on, just holds his right arm up. It's almost like he has a bird. <laughs> Another image shows crosses. Looks like there's no cross here. But they appear to be the most taken. He describes an encounter when he left a voice recorder out overnight. There's a message that wasn't very nice. What was that message? It was Die Pete. Three times. <laughs> Another electronic voice phenomenon or EVP message was left. This came from the grave. <laughs> Number four. Does that that's it. it. So at this point, a lot of people can agree Michael Jackson was one of the best musical artists of all time. And when he died, people were seriously upset. Uh, not so because they wouldn't be able to listen Michael to any more of his music, but because the world had lost one of the best icons of the era. But it turns out Michael Jackson might not have passed on at all. If you didn't know, Neverland was Michael Jackson's home and ranch, which is a place that showcased MJ's childish spirit, and it turns out that spirit might not have left at all. Essentially, during a CNN broadcast inside Neverland, a dark shadowy figure seems to float past and out of shot. Now, wasn't MJ back from the dead wandering through Neverland once again? Well, maybe not. According to CNN, a crew member named Larry King had walked past one of the lighting rigs that was being used to illuminate the corridor they were filming in, and that caused a shadow to show up on the wall. But on the other hand, are CNN being truthful here? I mean, surely if it was Larry's shadow, it wouldn't look so solid and real, but once again, it's up to you guys to figure that out. Did you see where that shadow was? It's meant to be in this hallway. I thought that they'd show it. I have seen the video, and it's just like, that it walks across there. Oh, uh, okay. But they didn't even show it. Larry King had walked past one of the lighting rigs that was being used to illuminate the corridor they were filming in, and that caused a shadow yeah, to show up on the wall. But on the other hand, are CNN being truthful here? I mean, surely if it was Larry Shadow, it wouldn't look so solid and real. Once again, it's up to you guys to figure that out. The bitch. Larry yeah, yeah. Inside Michael Jackson's bedroom suite oh, yeah, with yeah. Miko Breno, our tour guide here, and you're looking at the doors, and you can see the uh, locks on the doors. Miko, uh, privacy was key in this room, obviously. Yeah, he liked his privacy. When, when the doors were open, you know, it was okay, but when he locked, he wanted his privacy. He had his privacy. This is one of the bathrooms. <laughs> this is like obvious. It's like a shadow on the wall. Like, I love how like, they explain it. And it's like, do you guys believe that like, you're yeah, yeah. to hide something? Look at this. Exactly. They're out to hide the truth. <laughs> yeah, it's so funny. Number three. You saw them saying. So why did the ghost cross the road? That's a question viewers of the UK news channel ITV were asking in 2011 when a ghostly blob seemed to show up during a regular news broadcast. Now, I'll do my best to yeah, get a backstory, yeah. but essentially, a journalist is reporting from the scene of a car accident on the M11, which is a. <laughs> yeah, fuck that. <laughs> Let's go, like, um. I want, like, more. Maybe if we just do the, the old upload dead. Yeah. There's probably some raw, good ghost <laughs> 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 yeah. the, exact, the same, like. Oh, wait. Like, two what? different accounts. There must be some kind of spam. Spam anything. Upload dead. No, like, How long's it like. Three weeks. Uh, that's bizarre. Four months, six hours ago. Why is it doing that? Not Reddit reads. God, they're taking away our fucking searching power. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, like. Rating? Maybe? Feature. Oh, yeah, purchased. <laughs> Wait. Can you do multiple filters? I don't think so. Oh, maybe actually. Oh. Yeah, maybe not. Oh, yes. Real <laughs> guys. <laughs> that looks really good. 27 seconds, this is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is. What is this? This is so fun. Samir Ali makes a fun. <laughs> FX guru. What the fuck? Um, there's a lot of ghost recon. <laughs> a 
real veto. <laughs> a real veto of Ghost. 56 seconds. <laughs> this is good. This is what we want. I love like the thing is like the ghost, not like the dead part. Yeah, like, yeah, what is the ghost aspect? Child ghost spotted on a garage. So you don't want to make this kind of content. <laughs> That's a good. It's funny. Very explicit. Oh, I, gotta, I gotta pay Jacques. That's fair. I'm just gonna uh, 